joining us now is Mike Aubrey from HGTV Power Broker. Thanks for being with us today. Absolutely. So tell us more about your show. Well, uh, Power Broker is interesting because I think what it does is it combines not only real estate and a negotiation process that goes with real estate, yeah. but the money that the buyers that I work with on the show save, we then take that during the second half of an hour of the show and do major renovations to the property. Kind of adds two really cool things together. And how did you get into this industry? I'll be honest with you, I never wanted to be on TV. Okay. Um, Sabrina Soto used to do a show on HGTV called Get It Sold, and she moved from LA to the DC area and there was a very small spot on Get It Sold for a local real estate agent. She actually called to rent a place and that was how I met her. She gave my name and number to the production company. They called me, they said, if you want to do this small spot, we would let you if the network likes you. I did it, the next thing you know, they gave me my own show. And how's your experience been on the show? Do you like being on TV now? I think it's great, you know what? I think it's a lot of fun, I enjoy doing it and uh, six seasons later, I don't see myself getting off. Awesome. So what are some trends that are going on with home and reno? I think one of the things that you're starting to see right now is people, because prices have gone so high, yeah. they're starting to stay still. They're not buying houses right now. It's starting to slow down a little bit. And so because they're staying in place, you're starting to see them make the homes that they live in look much better. So you're starting to see stocks like Home Depot and Lowe's start to go through the roof as people are doing their own renovations. And how are you enjoying the home show so far? I think it's amazing. I mean, this is probably one of the biggest home shows that I've ever That's seen. Amazing. Okay, and how can people find out more about your show? Well, they can go to HGTV.com or they can go to MikeAubrey.com or they can always go to HossMagazine.com. <laughs> and where can people find you on social media? Social media, I'm at Mike Aubrey on Twitter. Um, I'm uh, Facebook.com forward slash Mike Aubrey 31 and uh, Instagram, I'm at Mike Aubrey. So this segment is called In the Hot Seat. What are some of your guilty pleasures? I gotta be honest with you. I think that probably my biggest guilty pleasure is cigars. I love them, I can't get enough of them. That's where I get the scratchy deep voice from. And if you were stranded on a desert island, what would you bring? A woman. So look into that camera and show us your best scary face. My best scary face. What's something you put beside your bedside table? A bottle of water. If you were a superhero, what would your power be? Um, I would be able to last longer than anyone in bed. Have you ever double dipped at a cocktail party? Absolutely. Air guitar or air drums? And let's see. I think I'm gonna go with air guitar and I'm doing the tea. Okay, what do you think that hoss means? For me, hoss is sort of like, I mean, you know I'm from the United States, not Canada. Yeah. And it's like something you would call somebody. Hey hoss, come over here. I'm digging hoss because it's a great one-stop shop to learn all about real estate, design and renovation. It is absolutely setting the standard for what's going on right now in that arena.